Alright, so we're on our way, finally. Yeah, those fucking hipsters. You can tell it's a hipster class because it wears skinny jeans. And it hates your musical tastes. There's a sub. Lots, lots of action going on here. Look at this escort doing his little... Little escort dance. Well, I can identify hipsters broadly. But uh, not in a way that... Uh... Yeah, exactly. <laughs> They're everywhere, man. Actually, where I tend to be in Portland, I uh, don't see a lot of bona fide hipsters anymore. I don't work in the part of town where hipsters like to go. Where they congregate in their little hipster clutches. Portland's a nice town, I just, I don't know. <laughs> kind of over it. Kind of done with it. Parts of it are really great, parts of it frustrate and annoy me. Oh, that guy came out of nowhere. Oh, because he's a little, little speedboat. Whoa, watch it there, Seagull. Whoa, that one fucking flew into me. You gonna pay for that? Look at the dent. Ridiculous. And he's gonna try to steer around me. Damn straight. Oh, I need to actually put crew on there. Oh well. I still haven't, uh, by the way, I still have not uh, <laughs> changed the uh, flat gun sound. No Punyu, I think it's an I boat. It's an overpriced boat that um, doesn't do anything different than the uh, other boats. <laughs> that was a good joke, everybody. Everybody liking that topical technical humor? Good joke. <laughs> Got a radio message. Let's take a look at that. Don't take a look at that, though. That's art, but it's naughty, naughty. A mines warning. British East Coast German destroyers have made success have made successfully mine locks. What are you talking about, you drunken asshole? Against enemy coastal shipping, the operations will be continued. Keep a minimum distance of 15 miles to the east of Britain in the area of Southend to Hartlepool, which I figured out how to pronounce uh, thanks to being gently chided <laughs> by some of my British viewers. Some of you are out there, you feel free to ridicule that pronunciation as well. I'm sure it didn't quite nail it. Such mines. Very explode. Wow. Yeah, is Yamoni on duty? Somehow, Ross's tanks is our radio man. Let's get Yamoni on the job here. I'd actually rather have him at sonar. And lethal should not be on deck. That'll do. It's not even porn. It, well, I guess it is porn. You know, let's go ahead and just say it's porn. Um, <laughs> in the eyes of some. It's, uh... <laughs> it's purely meant for titillation, I'm sure. I, for one, am not titillated. I just told Lethal to get off the deck, and he did. 
Yeah, I should watch it. He's got a mean right hand. Soviet Russia, lethal, deck you. Alright, we're gonna cruise at... I'm gonna go ahead and punch it up to 4096. Yeah, because he usually just has the one hand that has, like, a giant weapon on it. <laughs> Anything. I'm sure most of them are duds. Hellrath. Boobies and tits? Oh, well, I think uh, tits are pretty pretty excellent. Um, we have a lot of tits here in the uh, Oregon area. <sighs> These jokes. Is that the breast you can do? Sorry. <laughs> I'll, I'll stop. This is gonna this is gonna devolve quickly. We're we're all just picking low hanging fruit at this point. Let's let's just stop. Uh, we have an enemy task force. Oh, that's over here. This is probably a single enemy ship. I'm not going to pay any attention to it because we do have a um, an appointment at Lock U. So we're not going to pay any attention to this. Probably could not intercept that even if we wanted to because it's going medium speed. So I normally am loath to go at a uh, 1024 time compression, but eh, me. Nee. It is Glimner. Um, let's actually take a look. You know what? That may not be true. We're going to run a little experiment together. First of all, the seas are a little rough, so we're not going to get great optimal, the, the best uh, economy out of our engines right now anyway, but... It's this one, right? Maximum range at current speed. Okay, so let's actually increase that to 8. In, um... It depends on the U-boat, Glimner. We're using a Type 2. So the Type 2's engines are... Yeah, it's a smaller U-boat, so... Is that the best we can do? Let's set that up a little bit more, then. Well, wait, we want to have it so that we're making rotations under ideal conditions for 8 knots. So let's... Yeah, that's much less. So let's bring that down to there. Yeah, side by side, the Type 7 and the Type 2. Uh, the Type 7 is basically superior in every way. Uh, the only way it is not superior is that it is bigger than the Type 2. So the Type 2 is actually harder to see and also harder to detect using ASDIC. Um, the Type 2, I believe, dives quicker. It's supposed to dive quicker. Um, other than that, that's pretty much it. <laughs> that, that's essentially the... Uh, entire set of differences as far as I'm concerned. I may be missing something, but Type 2 has like, it has a smaller battery, it has a smaller amount of fuel, five torpedoes versus what for the Type 7? That would be 14, I think it is? I can't remember. Mr. Nickel, welcome. Willkommen. Uh, you haven't missed much. I rambled about the creator of Oregon Trail for a little while, and then I saw a battleship that was ours, and uh, now I'm sailing to lock you. And that's it. Guten Tag. Yeah, we, I made some bad jokes about uh, memories, uh, as did other people. I'm not solely to blame. What was my actual grid assignment? AO41? Nope. 
That's over here. Isn't it? Yeah, fuck that. <laughs> Sorry, that's not happening. Where we're even it's right there. Why would why? Ugh. I guess last month was Breast Health Awareness Month, wasn't it? Tail mange. Mange of the tail. The tail of the tail mange is an extraordinary tail. I don't know why that was sung to the tune of Chariots of Fire, but that's it. That's just how it went down. Oh boy, we are getting into some traffic here, it would seem. Also got some chop. Some choppy chop. Chop chop. Uh, probably ought to be careful here because that ship was on a course that might intercept with us. So far I'm not seeing anything. Might be beneficial to dive here. Slap chop. You're gonna love my nuts. Crocodile chop is actually pretty funny. Alright, let's take a listen. Oh. Well, there's a ship over there, but like I say, we have our... We have priorities. We can't, uh... Yeah. We don't necessarily want to... Well, he might cross our path, so... Let's get an actual watch crew on deck, then. And we do have one. Neeps! You need to go to bed, Neeps. There he is. Looks like a little collier or something. Mr. Nickel is actually a, a Scotsman, isn't it pronounced? Oh wait, yeah, did he... Is it lock... is it pronounced you like the... like... You're the best around! I don't know. It's not nothing is pronounced like that. Nothing should ever be pronounced like that. But is it pronounced like you, the 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 pronoun? Lock you. Lock me. Lock you. It's right here. This guy right here. I'm gonna circle it even more with my ruler. What the fuck are you talking about right now? You didn't want to give me a little heads up about that? With the little pop-up window? That would have been nice. That's bad news. Way off. Uh, that one might be a problem, though. Nope, we're good. Nice. Whew. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, Mr. Nickel. Is it nickel? I haven't actually checked. God, I'm just a fountain of questions about pronunciation today. I'll, I'll run, let me let me hit you with this. You and tail mange, uh, for that matter. 
This right here. Hartley Pool, right? Hartley Pool? Hartley Pool. Correct? Oh god. Yeah, those are swordfish. Uh, Parmentier. Nick all. Okay. <laughs> How about... Firth of Forth. Firth of Forth. Firth of Forth. Actually, this is, this is a tough one for me. Like, I would be tempted to drop the W there. Uh, Lochborough. Is it Larrick? Yeah, that's what I thought. I thought that the W would be omitted. What the fuck is this? Murther. <laughs> Murther, she wrote. <laughs> I didn't notice. That wasn't on the map in uh, GWX. Good stuff. Yeah, it might be... Uh, God knows if it's Welsh. It's probably like, probably like Martin <laughs> or uh, I don't know New York. <laughs> Anywho, uh, we managed to avoid that attack successfully. Thank God. Uh, I'm surprised that we're not detecting that ship on hydrophone, but we're gonna stay. There you go. Guess they had it for quite some time. Lest we be visited by further swordfishes. Oh, I could put some uh, Oregon places and Washington places in the chat and you'd be fucking ruined. Here you go. Actually, I can't really pronounce that one right. Alright, we're gonna go up. That's the one that uh, Grimith kept fumbling over in his uh, uh, Shadowrun playthrough. He called it just. It, there was the. He called it the Wargarble Barons. <laughs> you kind of. Cthulhu, you kind of just fudge it. It's Pialop. That's how I've always said it, and that seems to work. <laughs> yeah, there you go. One of um, one of our great mountains in the Pacific Northwest is called Mount Rainier, R A N I E R. Um, and uh, one of my friends, her mom, uh, when she first moved to Seattle, she pronounced it Mount Ranier, <laughs> which is just beautiful. It's very, very dignified. Um, what's another one? There's some that are just absolutely terrible. Well, Lamet is um, one that throws a lot of people. What the? DS Mufflin Koenig? Welcome. Uh, I think that that is uh, pronounced. It's um, about as close as I can get. Yeah, I mean, that's that's better than Run Yay, Cthulhu. Mount Rainer is at least in the ballpark. <laughs> Rainier is the the correct response. You know, there's actually in Oregon there is a uh, ghost town called Idiotville, and I want to become the mayor. I want to build a home out there and say that I'm the mayor of Idiotville. <clears throat> Gonna bump it up to 10:24. That is risky, but I'm gonna do it.
Yep, I know. I know that there was a ship reported, but I'm ignoring it. Either it saw me and I got lucky, or uh, it just didn't get close enough. Uh, 1024. Exactly, I think I can, I can uh, become the mayor without any opposition. Oh, it's December nineteenth. Wow. It's almost candle nights. I think candle nights is on the twenty-first. Nobody knows what I'm talking about. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to tell you right now that a man has entered the chat. A man who needs no introduction, but I'm going to give him one anyways. Lethal Feline! Oh my god, the game just chugged. That means that there is a convoy in the area. That's just outstanding. Um... And on the, you know, on the topic of shoutouts, which are, which are, you know, one of the internet's Favorite pastimes. Um, tail mange. Tail mange. That little rapscallion has achieved 5,000 subscribers. Everybody, congratulate tail mange. Tail mange. I hope that covered the John Cena. All right, anyways. <laughs> Tail mange has an interesting plan in mind, perhaps for uh, celebrating his his uh, YouTube pubescence. We'll see how that pans out. That's like his YouTube bar mitzvah, you know, five thousand. That, that's a that's a right. I got nothing. I really hate going at ten twenty four in the area of ports because unpredictable things can happen. But I'm gonna keep doing it. What we need to swap out our engine crew. Yeah, that'll have to be the way it's done. We'll put you in there and you in there. You in there. Okay. Oh, zing. Yamoni is being okay today. We'll see. We'll see. Lethal left, by the way. <laughs> he probably, <laughs> probably got fed up. <laughs> He's like, oh great, they're talking about me. What the fuck? Crazy cubicle guy. Greetings, my Freundiger. Alright, I'm gonna go to 4096. This might be a mistake. Small convoy headed west southwest at 5 knots. Um, let's increase our speed then. Pretty good, Freddy. I'm uh, a little bit of a tight spot here, but I'm doing okay. And we're good. Uh, right now, I am. Uh, I'm thinking I might do something a little later. I'm possibly going to stream a little tomorrow. Uh, possibly going to do a little bit of. Oh, shit. A little bit of oh shit. Where are 
are they? There they are. Oh my god, there's four of them! This is not good! <laughs> Oh my god. Rip in peace. They may not have seen me, or if they did, they're terrible. We're actually gonna be okay, I think. These are, again, these are swordfish. I don't know why we're running into so many of these, because they're carrier-based, generally. I'm sure that they can operate from land, but... Yeah, they're gonna fly right by me. <laughs> There's a merchant moving away. That's that convoy that um, we detected earlier. Sorry, Freddy. <laughs> Why don't you sit on Grandpa's lap? I ain't gonna bite you. I ain't got no teeth. <laughs> 